Uh, hi, I'm Eric Steele, um, longtime release manager for Plone, uh, and now the uh, newly appointed community manager. Um, I've kind of, uh, so now that we've uh, sort of broken up uh, Plone release strategy into separate parts, um, you know, with uh, kind of Plone Core, Vaulto, the API sections, um, we have several release managers now. Um, so, uh, I have plenty of people to pick up the slack, um, which is fantastic. Um, and so, yeah, uh, I've been asked to kind of take on more of a, uh, role to kind of give a more holistic view of the, of the community. Um, uh, it's something that we've been kind of missing for quite a while. Um, when, when, uh, Alex and Alan, uh, were around, uh, we had those sort of BDFL, uh, benevolent dictator for life, uh, folks that were keeping an eye on trying to make sure that the community was uh, advancing and, and little bits of uh, um, that, uh, uh, that there were th things were getting left behind that, that, that we were communicating with each other, that sort of thing. Um, that's something I would definitely really um, both Alex and Alan did this, but uh, Alex was really fantastic about it. Um, kind of having this uh, whole thing of uh, just pulling individuals into meetings and uh, identifying talent as it came up in the community. Um, and uh, I kind of hope to fill some of those shoes, but we'll, we'll see how it goes. Um, so, but the main, main uh, thing I, I'm doing now is leading our steering circle. Um, so this is a monthly meeting of sort of uh, team leads and uh, project leads throughout the Plone community. Um, we are getting together to just essentially primarily keep each other on task, uh, make sure that we're getting things done, uh, identifying any, any areas where we're missing, um, where we need help, where we need collaboration with other teams, where we need people. Um, and really that, that last one is really the one we need the most. Um, we have a lot of, we have a, well, yeah, we have a small number of people doing a lot of work um, and we can always use more hands uh, helping them out. Uh, some of the other things we're looking at. Um, so, so Plone, you know, has grown beyond just being Plone itself. We have, uh, we've taken on the Zope community. Uh, so we have code dating back over 20 years. Um, and we have things as new as, you know, today. Uh, lots of new technology coming in through Volto and others. Um, there's, yeah. So we have, we've got a wide range of things we're trying to keep track of, uh, making sure that uh, the older parts of Zope are still supported. Uh, making sure that we have new contributors coming in to support everything else uh, and that sort of thing.